Hello guys and welcome back for another tutorial. Today I will show you how to fix the adhesive.dll error on 5M. Uh, and there are two ways to do that. It's very easy in both two ways. The first way is to just uh, delete the adhesive.dll file on your computer. And uh, to do that, just go into your DLL files in the 5M folder. I will show you how to do that and just delete it and reinstall it on the internet. Now for the second method, which we are going to uh, focus on, on this video is to go into the code and modify it. So let's get straight into it. Now, uh, first thing you have to do is to open your files folder. So uh, just go here and search for run. And here type up data. Click enter. And here you will find uh, this up data folder. So go to local. And here go to 5M. So here my folder is empty because I have just uninstalled 5M, but you should find a lot of folders here, as you will see now. So as you can see, if you have uh, the 5M that is installed on your computer, you will find all these files. Now, uh, what you can do is just go to this adhesive DLL file right here, as uh, where my mouse is, and then just delete it and reinstall it from the internet. If that doesn't work, you have to go to the citizen FX file. So choose this citizen FX file right here where I hover my mouse and then right click and click open with Visual Studio Code. Now, if you don't have Visual Studio Code, it's okay. You can also use another uh, code editing app, but you just need uh, an app with, uh, that allows you to edit the code basically. So we will use Visual Studio in this example. So it's the citizen FX file, the first one, and then open with Visual Studio Code. Here you will find this code and in the update channel equals beta. And you don't want the update channel to be equal to beta. So just go here and then change it to canary. C-A-N-A-R-Y. As you can see on the screen, I will leave it for a few seconds to, to let you see it. So that was it, guys. It was very easy. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to like and subscribe if it helped you.